work in between? Uh, you've obviously known each other all that time, but did you work together outside of Yeah, we did um, yeah. Once Upon a Time in Mexico. Ah, Frida. Frida. Frida, yes, yes. I was like, like, like this in four rooms. I ah, didn't yeah. see my face, just my body. Right. And I was like, body, like body. this in one of the, the Spy Kids. Ah, there we go. I was thinking it's, it's quite fitting here, given that your first movie together was uh, Desperado 1995, that your meeting in this movie ends with a whap across the head with a guitar. Was there a yeah. feeling of, of sort of, we know each other so well, this is, because I know you had a day in the studio to work together. It must have been very natural and easy to do this. To whack me in the head of the, well, yeah. I didn't know, when I whacked her in the head with the guitar, I didn't it was know capture, that so. she was a woman. <laughs> Actually, it's what the, the, the movement of mine is what produced her to take the mask off and suddenly reveal the fact that she is a woman, and then he stops as a gentleman. Although I bet in the 18 years we've known each other, you felt like whacking me in the head with a guitar. Cover. Not all the time, <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> well, I was thinking you're both, uh, just as you showed before the cameras, you can bend and you can move, so I'm guessing when it came to that flamenco dance-off, I don't know whether that was uh, probably performance capture, given just how agile you people are. Should we say that we did it in this? Yeah, yeah quite not. Let's, we pretend did it was, it. let's pretend it was yeah. performance capture. We that did would work. it, yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> Yeah. Was, was, was it, with a movie like this, I, I was going to say, Salma, too, Black Leather really becomes you. Like, it looks incredibly well. I'm Thank sure it'll you. work even off camera, too. But, uh, but that notion yeah. of, of... I'll take that into consideration. Becoming uh, the cat. I know oh, you, you did yesterday. You were, I did yesterday, yeah. 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 I know that Sorry. you, Antonio, would, would... Obviously, you've had experience now. You have your sword in the studio. You have your hat. You're, you're kind of getting into the role. Was it easy for you, Selma, to sort of get to that place where, OK, I'm a cat now? She took her nails off <sighs> to do the character. Oh, that's... Tell the truth. Disgusting. Um, yeah, it was easy because I had a great director that just like walked me through it. And at the beginning, the character was, it, it, it was like um, Play-Doh a little bit. So we could actually get our hands in there and mold it with the director. And so that actually got me into it, that experience with Chris. So by the time I got to the microphone, the second time or the third time, I felt like a cat. I always think every kid, every movie that's aimed somewhat towards kids has to have a message. And the message here seems to be, if you put on kinky leather boots, who knows what you'll get up to. That, that is, that's the message, right? That's too <laughs> tough, man. I, don't, I suppose that this is not a show for kids, right? Oh, okay. Right. okay. Well, it's, a, it's a show for everybody, the whole family. Okay. Actually, there are some interesting messages in the movie uh, about uh, friendship and betrayal and forgiveness and i think my cat has a forgiveness for every sin and that's interesting that's good i like that about bad influences too but that's very important yeah, yeah. you know and uh, i actually love that, that egg i am thinking you know I've been, we've been doing this tour for all around the world and i start doing the tour hating him but after i've been doing so many interviews i start kind of liking him you know i i i, I think i had friends like him in school when i was a little kid guys that were very brilliant and they were you know inventors and creative and you know shiny minds and suddenly some accidents happen in their lives personal things you know psychological stuff uh, jealousy maybe uh, yeah. And they were left behind and they're nothing now. And uh, I go back to my land and I say, oh my God, that guy was so good when he was 10 years old. And that what happened to the egg. I love that guy. Yeah, <laughs> but jealousy would definitely turn you into a rotten egg. Yeah. Well, Hollywood's got to be full of uh, Humpty Dumpties in a way. No. No. I suppose everyone's happy there, really. Everyone's friends. <laughs> everyone's content. Everyone's self-satisfied. So. Honestly, Everybody's I have so found good a lot there. of great friends there. Yeah. I know there's a cliche about... Uh, I have found amazing. But this guy's been my friend for 18 years. And so has his wife. But wife I think, 17. I think success helps, though, you know, to, to be content within that world, though. You know, I'd say those who true. feel they're talented and they just never went anywhere, that's got to be a bit tougher than... It, it must be yeah. really tough. Yeah. I, I was going to... I have a few questions, but I know my time is tight. So I was going to say you know, the fact that you made Haywire with Steven Soderbergh in, in Ireland recently. But also, I'm, I'm guessing a name like Selma Valgama Jimenez. That sounds Irish to me. You've got Irish blood, right? Oh, let me tell you, I feel very Irish. I don't know why I have such a connection with this culture. And I think the Irish are the most Mexican people of the whole Europe. But that's made up. 
The whole name is made up. Ah, okay. No, yeah, somebody. There's also a guy. They said that I've been married before. You got it from the the. Uh, who knows Wikipedia? And all these different they, places. They did they, like yeah, yeah, yeah. Wikipedia, whatever right. that is. Wikipedia, they. Yeah. It's wicked. The Wikipedia is Wikipedia <laughs> and Wikipedia because it's not true. This I do martial arts, I, and it's not true. I, that's not my name. I know people just contribute, so they have fun with what what goes up there. So I think yeah, it's yeah. probably Antonio. I'm sure he's probably changing all your information. Maybe you have that look. Yeah, but how was how was that? Have a look in my eyes. Right? But I do love the Irish. <laughs> right, I got a rock. Yeah, she's gonna do an Irish. And Mariachi. I love my Guinness. Rock and roll. Let us know when you're coming. We'll we'll get. We'll make sure we have one ready for you. Okay. Yeah. Nice to meet you. <laughs>